Make sure you hit the subscribe button and the bell notification to let you know whenever I post a new video. Hey guys, what's up? This is Justin from Killer Performance and I uh, wanted to show you guys our newest OBS Chevy truck build that we got finished with last week. It's a uh, 1993 uh, Chevy truck and it is our ZR1500 package level three. So that means it's got an LT5 in it, 10 speed, it's got full level three suspension, powder coated frame, everything. I'm just gonna kind of go over the truck, show you guys what we did. But this one we did paint, interior, uh, drivetrain, everything. So this thing got it all. This is a $200,000 build by the time it's all said and done. Uh, so check it out, guys. It's pretty cool. Uh, under the hood here, you see we did a, this is a brand new LT5 crate engine from Chevrolet. Uh, we happened to get our hands on one of these before they went discontinued, so they're super hard to get. You don't see them in many vehicles, but we have one here in this truck. We go through there and we put an aftermarket camshaft in from Brian Tooley Racing, try and give it a little bit more rumble at idle and uh, a little bit more power as well. Um, we also run a uh, Speartech uh, LT5 10 speed combo, which utilizes uh, full flex fuel, so we can run E85 in this or 93 octane pump gas, um, so it's great for trips. Um, we have a Wagner front drive kit on here. We want to take a look at it a little bit closer. Uh, this is a Wagner front drive kit that we use. Um, it's got AC, it's got power steering. It utilizes the full 11 rib belt that an LT5 uh, requires, so it looks really nice. And then it also has a dry sump fuel system or a dry sump oiling system in it as well for the, the dry sump um, LT5 engine here. Um, we also go through, we change the radiator. Um, we make a custom uh, air intake for it. That's a five inch intake. Uh, Cordis Performance uh, supplies us with our uh, heat exchanger tanks. This is for the blower coolant that runs through. And then it also has a heat exchanger up here, which is also Cordis Performance. You can't see it, it's kind of hidden back behind there, but they make really good parts for late model uh, GM vehicles. So we utilize them on these as well. Uh, we also uh, do the QA1 full coilover suspension system. Uh, which utilizes full front coilovers and uh, coilovers in the rear. We get rid of the leaf springs, make it look all nice. Um, go around the truck here. These are our first for us. We went with a signature forged wheel. These are custom made, uh, build to order wheels. This is actually not a polished wheel. This is, an, this is a, a, a finish that they uh, actually offer now. It's called liquid platinum. And it looks like a full polished wheel, but it makes it super easy to clean. Um, then we have big 16 inch little shop manufacturing disc brakes on the front and rear of this truck, which is pretty cool. And then kind of walking back here, you see the awesome Zeus bronze paint job that we did on this truck. This is a 2020 C8 Corvette color um, that the customer wanted. And uh, our friend Pete Dutzel just killed the paint. I mean, he, he did a great job on it. It is painted top to bottom inside the cab, everything. This truck used to be bright red, so it's pretty cool to see it in this new color. Um, as you saw in the in the little footage in the front of the video, um, we have this full custom interior done by Classic Car Studios in St. Louis, Missouri. This is all using a factory interior without remaking anything, but using all new materials. So everything's leather wrapped, using you know OEM leather, suede, the customer wanted to keep a bench seat in there, so it's got a full bench in it now. Um, got a custom stereo, which will absolutely shake the walls. Uh, if you're in a building, it's it's pretty incredible. We got Dakota digital gauges, and we got a built specialties uh, steering wheel with paddle shifters to shift that 10 speed automatic. Um, but that's basically it. Got a, got a really nice truck here guys and uh hope you all enjoyed watching the build series but uh we're gonna go take it for a drive right now so let's hit the road
our 1500 truck, but the one that we just got done with, this thing is incredible. Drives awesome. Cruising 80 miles an hour right now. Just smooth as silk. Paddles working. I can't take it back. I think it need to mess with the alignment a little bit more. Pulls a little bit to the left. Let go of it. But everything's going good. We're taking this thing down to KC Detailing right now to get all the film done on it and uh, some paint correction. This thing's going to look just beautiful when it's all done. I hear you over there getting your rollers for you.